What is it? What, what is fascinating with VR is that a number of new experiences are possible. I think another project we worked on was uh, doing hand tracking. And that project was fascinating for because the outward looking cameras on your headset, uh, you know, on those guys, you have a bunch of cameras everywhere and they look at your hands. And uh, uh, another team worked on, on those uh, um, machine learning models uh, that would recognize, you know, that would interpret that as, uh, you know, bone rotations and, and positions and so on. And we did a number of interesting things with that. We built some plugin that would uh, recognize uh, poses like, uh, you know, thumbs up, uh, which is different from uh, some gun pose or, you know, that, that type of thing. And also we built another system, another layer on top of that would uh, recognize gestures. Uh, that's that's on the hand game play. Uh, it's it's in there. You people can go and explore that and uh, see what we did there. Uh, it's not easy because as soon as you leave the field of view of the camera, now oh my god, it's it starts to have a lot of errors and eventually it doesn't see anything, so it tells you so. Uh, but when it's in front of you, it works pretty well. We had some uh, um, sign language recognition at some point, which was pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I think there's a future for that for people that uh, would be able to communicate using their hands and it, maybe it would generate voice. Uh, that would be interesting. I think somebody should work on that somewhere. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, ex- it's going to make it definitely more accessible and inclusive for everybody to use these apps. Yeah, I think so. I think so. I think uh, there's a number of things there that uh, people could uh, definitely take advantage of for communication. Mm-hmm.